One thing that I've really observed since stepping into the additive manufacturing space is the, um, the element of collaboration within this environment, probably com compared to a conventional manufacturing space. All of the constituent players, hardware, software, um, parts manufacturers, are all really kind of tightly knit together in this space because the rate of development, the rate of innovation is so harsh uh, and so strong and so exciting that it's really critical for all those kind of constituent players to knit together and, and to kind of take themselves on that journey. There are a number of challenges for, for manufacturers when they're kind of add, uh, entering the additive space and then when they're really trying to scale in that actually so much of our learning within additive has been how do you make a part, not how do I make thousands of parts, how do I scale my manufacturing process. And I like to think that we're an important part of that journey for our, our customers to help them to scale up their manufacturing process because typically so many of the, the lessons learned in conventional manufacturing do apply to additive when you talk about scaling, but they apply in a slightly different context. And what we really try to do is work quite closely with our customers to understand how they go from making one outstanding part with perfect tensile strength that could be used in an aerospace, medical, automotive application, to producing high quality parts at high volume that can be, uh, can be utilized in a, in a mass production environment. A critical consideration for, for customers in the AM space is how do I go from producing this one part to doing it at scale at a cost-effective cost way? And I think one, one thing that's really critical for our customers is, is understanding how they knit together the, the varying technologies that they have within their, um, within their work centre. We're here at Rico today and we've got HP MJF machines. Fantastic machine, you know, renowned within the industry. And one thing that's really critical for Rico is to understand, okay, how can they integrate their software with the machine so they can really understand OEE, machine utilization, um, and kind of live build information so they can maximize um, the digital information that they, they're getting out of their, their workflow, their physical workflow on a day-to-day -day basis. And what we try to do as an organization, as AMFG, is to, to partner with the machine OEMs, but also with the, the end parts manufacturers themselves to understand what's really critical to them and understanding the, the real kind of challenges within their workflow and addressing those without our software solution.